our channel. So today we have this crazy Igloo Mania game sent to us by Brainstorm Toys. This game is five plus, it needs two to four players and it only takes 15 minutes, or around 15 minutes. So let's look inside. I'm gonna cut this other thing. Okay, so there's 64. Yeah, nice. Okay, so these, I was wondering whether they're on a separate bag, and it's because, I don't know if you can see, but they, these ones all have fives on them, so then there might be another one that has like six, and there's a base there, so you can stack them all up. Okay. We've got the little ice picks, and I think that is this, I think that's the top where Park, what was this name, Parker Pete stand. This is the Igna, yeah. and he's saying, hey, who's taking my blocks? Here are some stickers. So, so there's two Parker Peets, what? Oh, no, you put those behind. Oh, okay, so those are the stickers. And they, you stick them on the ice blocks. So I just opened five, so you would stick them all on five. And then there's four, there's one. And then them little things are your penguins. Okay, so I am going to stick these stickers onto the ice picks and get that set up. Well, Ro is going to talk to you about the game. With the igloo, it comes with two bits, but there's actually three. So it, it just comes like this, but you just have to lift it off. So it's very easy, you just get these, the little, what do you call that, a hole? The kind of hole thing? And then you just attach it to the little knobble things. But the idea of this is it's a mold, so once you attach it, so yeah, once you attach it, you can then, so this is literally a mold, because then you pick it up and you've got your igloo. So we need to put the stickers on the corresponding blocks, but do not open up all of these and then mix them all together because each packet is a different set of numbers. So like these are the twos, these are the sixes, and these, no, these are the sixes. Basically, you understand. But so don't mix them up until you've stuck the stickers on. Ow! So we're going to start building the igloo now, and to do that, what you do is you get your block. So it goes one, two, three, four, five, six, all the way up. And you make sure the number's facing up and you build around it one layer at a time. At a time, Ra. One layer at a time. Oh! So now it's time for Parker Peak to go on his igloo. Younger kids can play with the mold in, un, I mean, underneath the ice, the, the iceberg, the, in, in the, igloo, the, iceberg. <laughs> the igloo, or if, because we're a bit older, you can pick this up, and remove that, and then you have like nothing in there, so you can like, see underneath of that, Ooh. and then we can play like that. The rolls! Players take it in turns to use their ice pick to take out one ice block. I'm praying the whole thing does not fall down. Yes. And they need to get it on safely back in on front of them. If you take an ice block and drop it before it's in front of you, then you must take another turn. Like this. Oh no! Take another one. Please don't make this video. Yay! Nope. Oh. Yay! And you still have to have this one, so that's just a forfeit because basically you don't want to have the most ice blocks. So if you take an ice block and you pull it out, and then lots of others come down, others fall down outside of the igloo, you also have to take those ones as well. But if any of the ice blocks fall inside the igloo, Inside the igloo, igloo, when you take one out, when you take they one out, stay there until the end of the game. And the end of the game is when Peter Parker, no, what? Spider Man, what's his name? Pika Parker Pika. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's Parker Pete. When, whoever, whichever player makes Parker Pete fall down, they get all the unclaimed blocks, whether they're inside or outside the igloo. And the so let's play!
zoomed in and we don't even use counter blocks. Do you want to look how many rars got to collect? Destroyed as well. Nope, because uh -huh. you destroyed his home. Can I get him? Oh. <laughs> you know what? We can just give you a little That is not fair. Well, you've already lost so badly, so. There's Ra's collection. I'll my new home. I've got my little collection. Well, she's got a big collection. But I win! Yeah! This is a fun family <laughs> game because everyone can join it. The little, the, what are these called? Ice picks. So the ice picks, they're really sturdy and strong. So they're not going to snap. They're not going to break. The blocks are really easy. So it's really easy to build the igloo. This is not going to take you like an hour. So it's trying to build it. And all you do is like put them on top down get up there. And it's just really easy to build. It's really easy. It's also really fun building it. I don't know why. I have no idea why it's fun. You it's you can just stack them all up and, and then make it slots. It slots in like a little plate yeah. and you're just like, whoa! So the game would be really good. For, well, it is really good for all ages. But it's just so fun. It's like you're trying to get it out and you're like so tense. It's a really exciting game. Like shaking. And then someone pulls it out and you're like, what? It scares you so much when everything falls. Like it falls down and you don't know when it's going to yeah, fall. Yeah, you're like, it's, it's cool. like, yeah. Someone's just going to lock it over. And when they do, you're like, oh my God. It's also a really quick game, so it's really quick to put it together, and it's also really quick to play. It doesn't say you can, but you can actually try and play it on your own because you could like try and see how many you could pull out, pull out without how many you could try and keep in. This guy fall down, <laughs> and it also might make a really good playhouse. Some of the little figures we have it could be like their ice home. Thanks for watching our video. Don't forget to subscribe, and see you next time. Bye.